with the Minnesota Vikings. Cincinnati won the toss. They elected to defer. The Bears will start with the football, and the touchback will bring it out to the 25-yard line. 108 yards a week ago. And on first down from the 25, it's play action. And Dalton wanted to go deep. Nobody open. As the pocket collapses, he'll throw it away. Andy Dalton led Dallas to a win over his former squad. Montgomery on second down. And a couple to the 27. Dalton, pocket collapsing. Finds an open man. That's a first down to the 37-yard line. Darnell Mooney with the grab in front of Jesse Bates. Didn't have one last week. Eight drives, no three and outs for the Bears a week ago in their loss to the Rams. Dalton a wobbler, but it's caught by Mooney. Williams in motion. The flip to Williams and great penetration by Larry Ogunjobi. Oh, some pressure off the top there. Second and 15. Dalton throws short to Williams. Good play in open field by Akeem Davis Gaither, limiting the progress of the 48 to pick up a three. Third down and 12. Just a three man rush, but pressure comes on Dalton. Has to get away. Buys time down the sideline, trying to stay in bounds. Marquise Goodwin, what a good. catch, and a flag down. Let's check this out. Early on the field is incomplete pass. However, pass interference. Defense number 20. The ball will be placed at the start of the foul with an automatic first half. Two tight ends, Graham in motion. Dalton with time, checks it short to Montgomery, and the tackle made by Mike Hilton. Opening drive for the Bears, a second and seven for Chicago. Montgomery trying to find room up the middle, and he picks his way to the 11. Dalton to the end zone. It's Robinson for the touchdown. What a shot. Watch this, he's gonna break this route up right in front of the quarterback right here. Watch this, bam! Slams on the brakes there. Great move. And let his wide receiver win. Excellent job. Cairo Santos, good on the extra point. Don't forget, the Bengals gave up a costly penalty and the Bears capitalized. That really got this crowd into the game. Oh, a little bobble at the goal line on the return and not much running room for Brandon Wilson as a result. Ready for some quick game. Mixon on the edge, and a good job on that edge by Jalen Johnson. Bears hoping to add some pressure. They didn't put much on Matthew Stafford a week ago. Burrow, quick toss to the sideline. First catch for T. Higgins. Just three for 14 a week ago on third down for the Bengals. They've got a third and one here. Chase in motion. Mixon the ball carrier. First down to the 20-yard line. First down to give to Mixon. And Mixon down to the 22 yard line. Alec Ogletree. Look at all this communication on the road. Joe Burrow talked about that. It's got to be sharp. Second and eight. Mixon trying to jump to the right side. Joe Burrow knows all about Joe Brady calling plays for him as he did at LSU. Third and five. We'll see what play Zach Taylor calls for him here. Quick toss, and he tried to fit it in to Jamar Chase. After the play, unsportsmanlike conduct, taunting, defense number 38. Oh, wow. A 15-yard penalty is an automatic first down. That is number 38, first unsportsmanlike conduct. Absolute rushing penalty. Oh, and there's the taunting right there from... To Sean Gibson, you can't lean over and clap at a player. Burrow off the play fake with the pocket collapsing open over the middle and in to Bears territory goes Tyler Boyd down near the 47. What is it hot? Can't can. Can't can. Run left up at the top of your screen. There it is, Mixon able to cut it back a step to the 45. He picks up three. 
A taunting penalty keeping this drive alive. Second and seven for the Bengals, down a touchdown. Burrow, nice catch by Boyd. Ball a little bit behind him, and Tyler Boyd, who was all alone. Back-to-back -back weeks, this Bears defense has had a taunting penalty. This one very costly as the Bengals continue into Bears territory. Pocket collapsing, Burrow throws it away. Second down and 10. Out of the empty set. Four-man rush for the Bears. Burrow all over T. Higgins and nowhere for him to go. Burrow under pressure, down he goes! Robert Quinn got him! An effective quarterback like that, drop seven, stay too deep, keep all the routes in front of you, that's easy money for a defense. Kevin Huber's punt, fair caught. Dalton on first down, he'll give it to Montgomery, and Montgomery picks his way forward for three. You know, a lot of times coaching for a quarterback, and it is not an easy task, as Mark, I know you certainly know oh, yeah. what Andy Dalton is going through right now with a flag down before the snap. 100%, but just the awareness, understanding the situation at hand. For time the flag, out. a timeout is called Chicago. by the Bear. Second and seven, and now movement. Everybody pointing at everybody. This will go against the Bears. A lot of finger pointing. <laughs> It is fun, though, Mark. You play one year with Chicago, and Ball there's start. a lot of folks left in this organization Offense, and on this 74. team that you know. And to the goal. Second down. That on second and 12, pressure coming, and the pass deflected by Von Bell, who had an unabated path to Andy Dalton. And there's a flag. Unsportsmanlike conduct, taunting, defense number 24. A 15-yard penalty with an automatic first down. And that's when Bell got in his face and drew the flag. Big point of emphasis this year, as we mentioned with taunting, second taunting penalty we've seen today is Darnell Mooney. Lou Anarumo, just his third year as the defensive coordinator with the Bengals. That was a heavy play load a week ago in that overtime game against the Vikings, and Montgomery trying to take advantage of that. David Montgomery, seven straight games with 100-plus scrimmage yards and a touchdown. That is the best in franchise history. When you put a running back in the best in Bears history, you're talking about the best that perhaps ever played. Dalton fakes the toss to Montgomery. Has to check short to his running back. Nice move on the edge, and Montgomery turns a little play into a big one. A flag down. Montgomery motors all the way to the Bengals 26. Just a quick little stutter step. Jermaine Pratt. Oh, and that is such a tough spot. There are fouls by both teams, and they will offset. Personal foul, rushing the passer. Defense number 94. Holding offense number 84. Offsetting fouls, first down. And a rushing touchdown a week ago. Play fake, Fields, incomplete, trying to hit Goodwin. Up the middle, good hole for Damian Williams. Jermaine Pratt on the tackle and a flag down in the backfield. Illegal hands, hands to the face. Defense number 65. On his on his four picks. Dalton stepping away from pressure. Now he's gonna run. A lot, lot of room for Andy Dalton and out of bounds. Bird in motion on first down. Montgomery, patient run. Tumbles down with a flag down. Holding. Offense number 68, 10 yard penalty, replay first down. First down and 20 after the penalty, back to the 49 of Chicago. Bengals rush four, Dalton under pressure, has to scramble, Dalton tucks and runs, and Andy Dalton says Justin Fields. He's seven of eight, 41 yards, he's protecting the football. Here's Montgomery, short of the first down. Huh. Third down and two. Montgomery, nowhere to go. 
the door slams on David Montgomery. Here comes. Yep. And there's the sneak. Fields dives forward. Does he have enough? It looks like he does. Bengals take over after the defensive stop on fourth down when Fields' quarterback sneak is turned away. Mixon on first down. All right, Laura, thanks. Hopefully not as significant as it may have appeared earlier. Ready for a run out here. Oh, nice pass. Toss short. Catch made. Uzama with the first tackle missed, and he's able to. Third and six. Nothing wrong with a little slant here. Pressure comes, quick toss, Chase with a catch, and Chase with a first down. Play action. Burrow on the roll. Not much there for the tight end this time. Is trying to earn some extra time today as Sample comes in motion on second down. Now Higgins in motion. Mixing the carry. Oh, he faked going outside with his eyes. What a great look by Mixon. Third down and a yard after the eight-yard run by Mixon, his longest run of the day. Bringing in Chase to block Eddie, uh, um, Eddie Jackson off the edge. And look at him right there. That's exactly who they motioned him in for, to block number four off the edge. Got man-to-man -man across the board. Fourth and two, Burrow to the sideline and complete. He wanted Higgins, but Kendall Vildor slams the door. Kendall Vildor, though. May have gotten away with one. Bears take over. Andy Dalton back on the field at the 45-yard line after the injury. Dalton toss short to Montgomery, and Montgomery close to the first down. First down at the 45. Montgomery met in the backfield. Vaughn Bell throws him for a one-yard loss. Second down and 11. Four-man rush. Pressure up the middle. Dalton is down DJ Reader well that's back-to-back -back weeks now we've seen interior defensive line pressure from the Bengals that's a good trend if you're a Cincinnati fan Dalton Mooney and Mooney down to the 49 yard line to get back out there O'Donnell ready to punt it away and there is Phillips waiting for Cincinnati to return Phillips with a fair catch called Loving this empty set, giving Joe a chance to work this pass game, especially the quick pass game. First down, there's that quick toss, and it's Boyd. On second down, there's Mixon. Mixon in some trouble in the backfield. There is nowhere to go, swallowed up by Robert Quinn as we check in with Carissa Thompson. Bears are going to drop eight. Let's see what they do. Yep. Three-man rush, Burrow to the sideline. Open is T. Higgins and a first down. And movement on the left side of the line. Jonah Williams starting a little bit early. False start. Offense number 73. Five-yard penalty. Still first down. With all this space on the outside, nothing wrong working the bottom of your screen. Higgins over the middle, Shelley with the tackle at the 23-yard line. Pickup of eight on the play. It's Boyd in motion on second down. Mixon, a hop to the outside and leans through contact. Nice, Kev. Must have been rather bleak back in the 70s. Man-to-man -man across the board. Running back on a linebacker. Third and four. Pressure up the middle, and he throws it off the back of Johnson with Roquan Smith but they're gonna see that on the sidelines they're gonna get to check out those pictures and Roquan Smith has to be ready for that wheel route coming out of the slot Cooper's punt Simba Webster watches that one sail out of bounds near the 35 yard line as we showed you earlier Andy Dalton to the locker room with the injury Justin Fields will carry it the rest of the way at least in this half and on first down nothing doing up the middle a lot more shotgun action and gun run action so they can run read option. Fields off the pump and Fields to the sideline out of bounds. Third down and five. Fields to the sideline. Wow. Good throw. Nice. Darnell Mooney with the grab. First completion for Fields. 
Motion from Cole Komet. From the 49 on first down. Bengals bring five. The pressure gets to Fields, and down he goes. And nothing's open here. They had this thing covered. Just a shallow cross. They got the stop over the ball. I mean, there was nowhere for Justin Fields to go. To the sideline now. Tall throw. Climbing the ladder to pull it down. Marquise Goodwin with Eli Apple. Have this third down and nine play. And potentially in four down territory, you don't have to get all nine yards. Five man rush. Pocket holds. Late toss. Incomplete. Which we appreciate it. Always good to hear from Dean in our studios in Los Angeles. Fair catch called for and made at the seven yard line. It's down and ten at the eight yard line. This is Mixon. And Mixon. The Bengals a little bit of breathing room out to the 17 as we check in with Carissa Thompson. The issue here for Joe is can we get enough yards to get us into field goal range? Let's see if they can get a couple quick strikes. They need some chunk plays. Burrow not going to get a chunk play here. Instead, it's the Bears who take a chunk out of Joe Burrow. 7-0 lead for the Bears. Bengals won the toss, elected to defer. Brandon Wilson going to bring it out of the end zone after a bit of a hesitation. Wilson slipping tackles and stumbles his way to the 23-yard line. We did see him in practice on Friday taking a couple of snaps, almost a wildcat roll. First down. I want to cut you off, but I was, I was calling for the run to the left, baby. <laughs> Not much up the middle. Angelo Blackson, the first one there. Roquan Smith with the stop as well. He's a great pass protector, too. He understands pass pro really well. Burrow hit as he throws over the middle. Ball out, loose on the turf. And Samaje Piran, not only good at pass pro. Uzama in motion. Go! Off the play fake. Burrow going deep, looking for Higgins over the middle off his fingertips. Collapsing again, and there's the sack for Khalil Mack. Third and 16. Four-man rush. Burrow in trouble again with pressure up the middle. Burrow. This will tiptoe out of bounds, and then he gets nudged oh. down by Robert Quinn and the Bengals. First and the foul. Unnecessary rushing. Defense from the 94. Second Cincinnati drive to continue with an after-play flag. First down and 10, and Mixon up the middle, lowers the pads, and down to the 49-yard line. That's Higgins in motion on second down. Mixon the carry on the counter, trying to bounce to the outside. Good cut by Mixon, and a first down. And on a hot day in Chicago, Mixon on the sideline. Samaje Pirine, the running back. Play action. Burrow steps up. He'll check down to Pirine and threw it a little too tall. Much more discipline, and Sean Desai, their defensive coordinator, was talking about that all week. Second down and 10. Tenth play of the drive from the 41-yard line of the Bears. Burrow in trouble again. Down he goes. Fourth Bears sack. This one for Roquan Smith. Third sack on the drive. Fourth on the day. Third and 18. Pressure coming again. Quick toss. Looking for running room is Chris Evans. Trying to get the Bengals on the board in Chicago. McPherson's kick is good. Awaits the kickoff. Bengals with a 53-yard field goal to get on the board. Makes it a 7-3 ball game. And the Bears ready to go to work in this second half touchback. will bring it out to the 25-yard line. for Quarterbacking in this game today. Fields on first down. This is Montgomery. Patient to the edge. And Montgomery with good balance as well. It sure seems that way. Here's Fields trying to get to the edge, breaks the Hendrickson tackle, and Hubbard catching up with him, but a first down to the 36-yard line. But we don't want that. He's got to get down and avoid some major shots. And the current quarterback hands off to that backup quarterback who spins through a tackle. He found the circle button, Mark Sanchez, and a first down, a pickup of 11. Worked a lot on his speed in the offseason. When he came out of Iowa State, there was a lot of talk. Wasn't fast enough, a 4-6-3 in the combine. Got him on top. Mooney. Mooney off his fingertips at the 30-yard line. Hey, 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 hey. 
Look at him changing the mic point. Seven three lead for the Bears. Excellent read. Hey, Fields called it. I mean, they. He, I think it's a defensive penalty here. Let's see. Oh wow. Let's see who jumped first. Effetti just took him out of rhythm a little bit, so he's got to be calm with his voice and his voice inflection. Second down and 15. Fields, nobody open, making plays, and he slides down at the 49-yard line. Pickup of seven. And making it tough on your offense. Third down and eight. Bengals bring five-man pressure. Fields in trouble. Ball is out. Loose on the turf, and Fields is able to recover it. Ticketed for the end zone, and Fields made a pretty good defensive play to knock it down and knock him down as well. Great awareness by Fields. There is Phillips, tiptoes down the sideline. Nice move by Phillips, and he'll hop out of bounds. With Mark Sanchez, Laura open on the field. I'm Kevin Kugler. Best starting field position of the day for the Bengals from the 35 yard line. Five man pressure from the Bears. Burrow from the pocket has time to find Higgins who drops the football and it's scooped up by Chicago. To Sean Gibson's got it. And Gibson down at the Bengal 40 yard line. Excellent read by Joe Burrow. He found him over the middle, makes a great read and a great throw. And Higgins, oh, Eddie Jackson got a piece of that. Knocked his hand out. And there goes the football to Sean Gibson, Johnny on the spot. Excellent job scooping that thing up. Kev, that's a, that's a country fumble. That means there's nobody around. When it's a city fumble, there's too many bodies. You don't pick that thing up, you fall on it. Country fumble, huh? From the 39-yard line, Montgomery with the carry into the arms of B.J. Hill. He runs. And when it's a city fumble, there's too many bodies. Just fall in the prenatal position to cover up the football. Second and seven, Montgomery working to the edge, just a yard. But right now, it's Justin Fields' ball game. And they got man to man. Nothing wrong with Cole Komet. Oh, come on, guys. And movement up front. Bengals leaned first, but ball then. Start. Offense number one, five yard penalty, third down. Call it on Fields? They called it on the quarterback. Nothing wrong with Cole Komet. They're going to try and play one-on-one, -on -one, man to man. Find your backs and tight ends. Fields to the sideline. There's Robinson. Breaks oh. a tackle, and he's got a first down. That's Jimmy Graham in motion on first down at the 29. Fields, good protection this time. Good ball to the sideline where Mooney is waiting, sliding down at the nine. First and goal, Bears. First and goal, Montgomery met in the backfield and twists down to throw the ball while he's attacking the line of scrimmage. Fields with time. Fields on the roll. Chased by Hubbard. Fields down the sideline and out of bounds at the six yard line. That foot caught the sideline out of bounds. Montgomery in motion. Graham to the bottom of the screen and flags. He's moving. Fields is moving too much. Ball start. Offense number one. Five yard penalty. Still first down. Is this just rookie anxiousness of the big moment? To prove it, but first they've got to get a stop on third and goal. Fields with pressure for the end zone. Incomplete. He was trying to find Robinson. A 27 straight dating the last year. As Santos. Puts this one right down the middle. Well, certainly a better defensive effort today. And one of the reasons why you're seeing a better defensive effort is Brandon Wilson, a yard deep, will bring it out of the end zone, is the play of Khalil Mack today. He's made more of an impact in this game. So now first down at the 17-yard line for the Bengals. Here's Mixon. Trying to pick his way through a lot of traffic and down to the 20-yard line. Joe Burrow and the Bengals offense find some rhythm here in this fourth quarter. Second down and seven. Block. Eddie Jackson, here he comes again. And they'll run right into that with Mixon. And Mixon down near the 24-yard line as we check in with Carissa Thompson. One score game, Burrow's got to be real sharp here. He just wanted to get a look, now he's calling his play. Play clock under 10. 
Jamar Chase, the rookie from LSU, has been quiet today. He's at the bottom of the screen. And he finds Boyd, and Boyd on the loose, and Boyd with a first down to the 45-yard line. And Joe doing a lot at the line of scrimmage. They got the numbers to run it. And they will run it with Mixon, who slips through traffic, and Mixon hogtied at the 49 by Akeem Hicks. Continue to pound that rock and matriculate the ball down the field. Mixon again. 18th carry from Mixon. He's got 63 yards as he takes it to the 49. Sean Desai wants to put a little pressure on Burrow and bring somebody. He talked about communication. Playing in front of a hostile crowd for the first time since college. Crowd trying to make it more difficult now. Burrow throws. Intercepted. It is picked off. And on the run is Roquan Smith. Down the sideline. Smith gets a block all the way. The pick six for Roquan Smith. And Joe Burrow just lost sight of Roquan Smith. He starts to drift under this sit route by Boyd in the seam right here. That's who he was throwing to. And he lost vision on Roquan Smith. Excellent play by him. Just slowly inching his way. Burrow had gone 199 consecutive passes without a pick. It's hot. It's good. We're good. Down two touchdowns now from the 25-yard line for Joe Burrow and company. It's Mixon on first down, and Mixon brought down by Bilal Nichols after he picks up three. He's not afraid to miss any shots. He's not afraid to throw the next interception. He's ready to rock. Play action. Good blitz pick oh. up by Mixon, and it's intercepted. Jalen Johnson with the pick. After the second straight pick thrown by Joe Burrow, and on first down, it's Montgomery with the carry, and not much there from Montgomery. On that pass. He knew the ball was in the air before the receiver did. Absolutely right. Fields, protection, going deep, looking for Robinson in the end zone, and Awuje bats it away at the last moment. I mean, those ones, you got to help out your young quarterback here. Third and nine, Bengals rush five. Field steps up, throws, caught. And a first down, Komet is down at the 22-yard line. A flag is down. Pass interference. Offense number 85. A 10-yard penalty. He's got to push Third off. Down. Pushed off a little too hard. Let's see where there's Cole Komet inside. Just a little shove there working against That's Von Bell. Push. Disagree with the pass interference call. Shocking. Third and 19. Fields checks it down to Montgomery at the 45. A little stiff arm by some space, but not enough to get past the 40 yard line on Monday for the Rams. First three and out this season for the Bears. And the punt to Darius Phillips as he waves for the fair catch. It'll go into the end zone. Bengals' last three possessions all have ended in turnovers. Back-to-back -back picks as Burrow will throw on first down. Pressure up the middle. He's hit, and it's a third straight pick. A third straight interception. This one for Angelo Blackson. Or else you're going to have disasters like that. Flag came down after the play. There's no flag on the play. Interception. Commit in motion. Fields on the keep, looking for a block. Couldn't find one, and Awuje with the tackle. Joe Burrow feeling the weight of the world on his shoulders. Defense got to help him out here. Second down, Montgomery had a little trouble securing that handoff. That one almost squirted out as he got it under control near the four-yard line when Cam Sample brought him down. Look at that advantage he's given up out here. Now they're bringing in the safety to help out. Third and goal. Field looking. For the end zone, Mooney the intended target. Cairo Santos. On for the chip shot field goal, and it makes it 20 to three, Chicago. And then the third one, we just gotta get better in pass protection, Joe Mixon, that's two weeks in a row that it's really hurting you. Kick off through the end zone. He made me feel a little bit better. First down and 10 for Burrow. Pumps, pressure again, gets rid of it to Boyd, and Boyd 
down at the 30-yard line. I know the headlines. He's old, not as good as he was, but his focus now, right where we see him today, having a great game. And he's really played well, and as we speak of him, he comes up to make a tackle. Thank you, Akeem. That's good television. Four-man Bears rush. Burrow with time, looking deep for Chase, and that one out of bounds. No chance. Kyle Wu and Oliver Moody, our broadcast associates. Michael Nathanson, our technical producer. Great to have our crew back and going again here in Chicago this weekend as Joe Mixon works his way forward to the 43-yard line to make the postseason. Bears trying to avoid that today, and they're in good shape right now. Third and seven. Burrow, good toss and catch. Tyler Boyd with a first down at the Chicago 41. Watch Joe Mixon help out in pass pro right there. Boom, just get a piece of the edge. Burrow looking deep for Chase, and Chase makes the adjustment, and Chase will walk in for his second touchdown of the season. Connects for the second time this year for the Bengal Tigers. And look at Chase just run by him. See, these are difficult when you go inside on a go ball because the safety generally has a chance to make a play because they know exactly what to expect, and that's so important for a quarterback and his receiver. Extra point by McPherson is good. Will we see it? McPherson going with Pooch. Bit of the pooch here to the 10 yard line. Rooney out of bounds. Keep riding that run game. Don't throw it if you don't have to. Here's Montgomery on first down. Spins down to the 24 yard line. It's second and six from the 24 yard line for the Bears. Under four minutes to go in this one, 20 to 10. Chicago, Montgomery, penetration in the backfield, and he's down. Third and eight, pressure again. Field throws, and it's intercepted. Logan Wilson with the pick, and it's first and goal, Cincinnati. Wilson down near the seven-yard line. On the field's pick, first and goal. Look at the height advantage outside on both of these wideouts. Nothing wrong with that. Burrow throws for the end zone. It's a touchdown to T. Higgins. Look at T. Higgins. And watch him post up the defensive back right here. Look, push off of him, just like he's boxing out in basketball on the low block. That's all he had to do is get position, and Joe Burrow knows. As soon as he starts to make his turn, that ball is out, and I'm going to put it in between the eight and the five and let him fall down right in the end zone. I'd say absolutely not. The kid's back on track. Evan McPherson for the extra point. It is good. One punched out football for a fumble and a recovery by the other team. If you can't handle that roller coaster, if you can't stay steady like Joe Burrow, you're gonna have you're gonna be in a world of hurt trying to play this game. Montgomery with him in the backfield. It'll be Montgomery on first down, and Montgomery finds very little. Maybe a yard. Nothing wrong with using your legs and Especially after that fumble, two hands on the ball in the pocket. Second and nine. Pressure comes. Fields hit as he throws. Driving on full commit is Jesse Bates. Momentum clearly on the side of the Bengals right Here now. Up in the slot. Not a bad option. Fields in the pocket. Helmets flying. Fields breaks a tackle. And this is what Fields can do. Scrambling for the first down to the 36. 180. Robinson in motion. Montgomery picks his way forward and a good run on first down to the 42 yard line. Picks up six. Logan Wilson on the stop. The Bengals with one timeout remaining on second and four. Here's Montgomery. Picks his way forward. Backing towards a first down and I think he's got it. Bengals are out of timeouts. Fields takes the knee for Joe Burrow and Justin Fields. We'll take the knee. Programmers how to program their sports talk shows in the city of Chicago over the next week, and I don't think I have to. Andy Dalton, Justin Fields. That will be a dominant conversation in the world of sports talk over the next week here in the city of Chicago. Justin Fields does enough today to get the win over the Cincinnati Bengals.